In Virgo, you need to know this right now for January the 8th through January the 9th, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for January the 8th through January the 9th, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for January the 8th through January the 9th, 2024. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the star sign of Virgo for January the 8th through January the 9th, 2024. Show me. You guys, subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. If this does not resonate with you, check your moon, rising, and Venus sign videos. I do not read reversals. So, Virgo. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Virgo, these are your cards, honey. So, <clears throat> Virgo, you have the magician. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but you're trying to manifest, trying to make something happen. And you have all the tools and resources available to you to manifest whatsoever you will. You have the earth element, the water element, the air element, the fire element, and the ethers. So with great focus and intent, you can manifest. So Virgo, could be dealing with an Aquarius, but you're trying to make something happen here. Clarify the magician for Virgo. Clarify the magician for Virgo. Clarify the magician for Virgo. It is clarified with the Ace of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is truth. This is clarity. This is communication. Now, this could be the sword of decision, the sword of victory. But this could also be the sword that one reels to sever a relationship. <clears throat> so, Virgo, listen, you can tell me that you're trying to manifest communication. You can tell me that you're trying to manifest some type of truth and clarity coming out. You can tell me that you're trying to manifest making a decision or using this sword to sever. Virgo, you have the page of swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, this is immature, premature communication, but this is also you spying, researching, investigating, looking into someone, looking into someone's social media, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, riding past someone's home, riding past someone's job, asking a friend of a friend of a friend. This is you doing your due diligence to gather information and research, looking into something. So Virgo, you can tell me that you guys had this immature, premature communication, or you went looking and spying. Clarify the page of swords for Virgo. Clarify the page of swords for Virgo. Clarify the page of swords for Virgo. It is clarified with the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting your wish, being divinely guided, following your destiny. So Virgo could be dealing with an Aquarius, but you can tell me that you're getting your wish, following your destiny. You can tell me that you need to heal individually on your own, or you're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out, and reconcile. Clarify the star. For Virgo, clarify the star. For Virgo, clarify the star. For Virgo, it is clarified with justice. Could be dealing with a Libra, but you may be calling for karmic justice, saying, you know what? I'm a good person. I put good out there. I'm just expecting that good to return to me. Or you're saying that someone did me so wrong and so dirty, I'm calling for karmic justice. I want them to get exactly what they deserve. Or you're dealing with something in the justice system. So listen, Virgo could be dealing with a Libra, but you can tell me that, hey, something isn't fair, something isn't balanced, something isn't just. You can tell me that someone wants to come in and right a wrong and bring justice to a situation. Or you're dealing with something in the justice system. Clarify justice for Virgo. Clarify justice for Virgo. Clarify justice for Virgo. 
It is clarified with the Page of Swords again. Hmm. Like I said, you guys could have this immature, premature communication, or you went looking and spying, researching. Clarify the Page of Swords for Virgo. Clarify the Page of Swords for Virgo. Clarify the Page of Swords for Virgo. It is clarified with the Six of Wands. Aries, Leo or Sag, this is getting attention, getting recognition, rising above the crowd, getting the accolades, the pats on the back, being triumphant, getting the victory, victory and success. But this can also speak to something being brought to your attention or you're beginning to recognize something or you're getting attention and recognition. So Virgo, they could be getting your attention. You could be getting their attention. You can tell me that something is being brought to your attention. You're beginning to recognize something here. Or this is an announcement being made. Now Virgo, you can tell me that you're wanting to get their attention because you want to have this conversation with them. Maybe trying to manifest conversation, okay? Communication here. Maybe to right a wrong here or to explain what you felt wasn't wrong here so that you guys can heal things. Virgo, you can tell me that something is being brought to your attention when you go looking and spying here and you feel like it's not fair, balanced, or just. You're wanting to get to the truth. You're wanting some type of truth and clarity concerning something here. Virgo, you have the King of Wands. Aries, Leo or Sag, this king is a very charming, charismatic character, someone who's admired by many. This is a leader, a go-getter, a take charge type of energy, someone who sets out on many objectives and usually accomplishes them with a lot of passion, effort, and energy. You could be dealing with this Aries, Leo or Sagittarius, or someone with fire prominent in their charts. However, you could be taking on the energy of this King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands is someone who's highly motivated, a self-starter, someone who gets things done and makes things happen with a lot of passion. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or you're wanting to take action. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. Clarify the King of Wands for Virgo. It is clarified with the Ten of Wands. Aries, Leo or Sag, something is difficult. Something is heavy. Something feels like a lot of work. Something feels like the weight of the world on your shoulders. Something is a burden here for you. Now, this is a 10, so this is an ending. This is you wanting to release a burden. So, Virgo, you're telling me you're having a difficult time. Something is burdensome, and you're just wanting to release it. Now, I feel like you're wanting to release a burden here. And you want to communicate with this person or you want to release a burden because you want some truth to come out about based on something that you're finding out here you're wanting to bring it out virgo you have the three of swords gemini libra aquarius this is heartbreak this is pain this is suffering this is agony caused by a third party situation so when i say third party yes a romantic third party but this could also be meddling family members friends co-workers neighbors anyone being involved in you guys's relationship that shouldn't be that is causing you heartbreak so virgo you're telling me that you're hurt now you could be hurt because your feelings are hurt or you're hurt because there's a third party Clarify the Three of Swords for Virgo. Clarify the Three of Swords for Virgo. Clarify the Three of Swords for Virgo. It is clarified with the Seven of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is having many options, but all of these options aren't viable. Now, this can speak to confusion, wishful thinking, fantasy, illusions, but having many options. So Virgo, you can tell me that you're all up in your head fantasizing here. You can tell me there's some confusion. You can tell me that you need to make a choice. You can tell me that there was lies and illusions or the fact that someone had other options and explore some of those other options. Now Virgo, listen, you can tell me that you're hurt because of confusion because you're wanting to get to the truth of something. Or you're hurt because of lies and illusions or the fact that they had other options, a third party here. And you're wanting to get the truth out of them. Virgo, you have death. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, but death symbolizes to end something, only to begin something new. Death symbolizes transformation, rebirth. 
could be dealing with a Scorpio, but you can tell me that something is ending here. Something could be starting new after an ending or some type of transformation or change. Clarify death for Virgo. Clarify death for Virgo. Clarify death for Virgo. It is clarified with the Six of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is moving away to calmer waters, moving away to a place of peace. So either mentally or physically, you're wanting to move away. Now, this can speak to if you guys had any type of disagreements or arguments between you. Agreeing to disagree, letting bygones be bygones, and moving away to a place of peace and harmony together. Or this is you saying you just want to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. So Virgo, you can tell me that you're physically moving or traveling. You can tell me, hey, let's just put it behind us and move away to a place of peace and harmony together, letting bygones be bygones. Or you're saying you just want to move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. Now, Virgo, you can tell me that things are ended, but maybe you're wanting to start new after ending and put things behind you. Virgo, you can tell me that you're wanting to end things and just move, physically move away from the relationship. But Virgo, I feel like you're wanting to end things and move out, move on, and move away from the relationship. You're trying to manifest severing with this person. You're wanting to release this burden here. I'm going to take a look at the situation ship for you, Virgo. Now, this is just additional messages here. Okay. And it says... Alien, telepathic dreams and songs. Alien, telepathic dreams and songs. Okay. <laughs> what else for Virgo? What else for Virgo? And it says, obsession must have indulgence. Obsession must have indulgence. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Virgo, you need to know this right now for January the 8th through January the 9th, 2024. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at herimmortalmaj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.